Brigadier General Aziz Nasirzadeh, who has been picked by Iranian President Masib Kazeshkian to run the Ministry of Defense, has presented Parliament with his proposals for further development of the country's defense sector. Nasirzadeh, who currently serves as the Deputy Chief of Staff of the Iranian Armed Forces and used to command the country's Air Force from 2018 to 2021, provided the legislative body with his proposals on Wednesday. The plans outlined his visions for additional expansion of the Islamic Republic aerial and naval warfare capabilities, missile technology, air defense prowess, and aerospace division among other things. As means of enhancing the Air Force, the senior military official advanced designing and production of jump jets, which are capable of vertical takeoff and landing. He also proposed improvement of artificial intelligence technology across the country's drone squad to further equip it for swarm flight operations. Nasirzada suggested development of heavy multi-mission destroyers through acquisition of relevant technology as well as enhancement and production of high-speed vessels that are capable of launching cruise missiles. To develop the missile sector, he suggested improvement of the country's capacity of producing various types of ballistic crews and air defense missiles with diverse ranges and capabilities in proportion to the armed forces' current and future needs. A high-ranking Iranian military commander says various types of military equipment entirely designed and manufactured by the country's technicians are on par with its world-famous drones and missiles. The official, meanwhile, advocated additional improvement of the country's space technology, suggesting development of the technology and capacity of its satellite launchers and placement of more than 20 satellites into orbit in the future. Using the capacity of defense diplomacy to facilitate the export of defense products, increasing interaction with neighboring counties as well as Latin American and African states, and creating the necessary platforms to double the export of defense products are among his other plans. Iran has been relying on domestic endeavors and know-how amid sanctions to make significant advances in enhancing the self-sufficiency of its armed forces. Heeding the directives of leader of the Islamic Revolution Ayatollah Said Ali Khamenei, Iranian officials have repeatedly underscored that the country would not hesitate to strengthen its military capabilities, which are entirely meant for defensive purposes and are, therefore, never subject to negotiation.